don't get in trouble. Now, because we are indeed in production now, I'm back to the future two and three, and we're inside a courthouse square now. Amblin Entertainment that produces Back to the Future two and three, and one for that matter. Uh, they put out this spiel, and I'm supposed to do this like verbatim, so forgive me, I'll read this to you here. It's hokey. They want me to say this, I'm sorry. Now, we're about to take a trip to the future. Back to the future, that is, as we enter Courthouse Square in the town of Hill Valley. Now, those of you who saw the movie Back to the Future recognize the clock tower on Paul's side of the tram. That's where the courthouse was, and uh, lightning struck that clock tower. Matter of fact, the street that we're traveling, you get a little better look at all of the sets in this area. Actually, what we're now in is the year 2015, if I remember correctly. Yeah, Back to the Future Part 2 has just finished filming right now. They're going into production on Back to the Future 3 at this time. Let's see here. Let's skip ahead a little bit. You may remember there was a parking lot right there in the middle of the square where the fountain is now. It was in the, uh, you remember that at the end of the first Back to the Future, but in the year 2015, they put a pond in there, a little fountain. There was all kinds of water in there, a little fountain that spouted up to beautify the town. The green building on the corner, now those of you in the first and second cars, you kind of have to look back to see this. The third and fourth cars look straight across there on my side of the tram. That was the malt shop in 1955 where Marty first ran into his future father, George McFly, when George was still a teenager. What happens to that building in the future? Well, you got to see Back to the Future Part 2 to find out. Next to that is the antique store over there, and right up ahead here where I am now, the sub, you remember, the end of Back to the Future 1, we don't need roads where we're going. Remember that? Christopher Lloyd came back in and uh, raided the trash can to get fuel.